so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the containers out to the raft. And we're going to drop them like so. And then position them inside of here. See, I, did, I haven't done this on buoy balls. I've done it on tires. So I don't know. Maybe buoy balls are a little more unstable. If you stand on that, it really does the little shake, shaky thing. But we want to turn it this way because then we can get more in there. And, and we should be able to get up to seven in there assuming they behave. All right, welcome back everybody to Sir and Deep. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to hopefully finish our raft and get off this island and hopefully get to a player made island, a modded island, and establish our home base. So that is the plan. Uh, I got a couple pieces of meat on the fire. Let's grab that. And how is our food? Yeah, we could stand to eat one of those that tops us off. I've got all these chests over here. Um, labeled and organized. So crafting mats are in here. Equipment's in here. Plants. Parts. Parts 2. Food. And tools and weapons. Okay. And I grabbed everything off of the rubber raft because we will not be taking the rubber raft with us when we leave. Let's go ahead and get some more food on the fire just so it's ready for uh, to go for us later on. Oh, gross. And then we're going to go hit the last couple of wrecks around here and hopefully find some more buoys. That is the plan stand. Let's grab a couple more pieces of wood here. Stoke the fire. Grab this. Stick it on there. Drop the other one. Pick it up. Stick it right here and try that again. There. It should stay there. Okay, uh, let's get a drink of water, too. How much water do we need? Let's drink the whole thing. And then we'll just restock our palm fronds here. All right, we're ready to go for the day. So these are all empty crates here that we're going to be uh, ultimately put on our raft. Uh, so let's head on out and check these other wrecks. And uh, if we're lucky, we will find... Two more sets of buoys that we can finish our raft out so it's a, a complete 100% buoy raft. Now, it doesn't need to be that, but, oh, well, here, this is going to be an option for us then, too. <coughs> it doesn't need to be, um, but it'll just, you know, it'll look nice if it's if it's all the same, same deal, right? Okay, let's get up, get some air, check and see what's inside of here. Uh, we got a, a container, so we'll grab that. And a locker. Okay, we'll grab that stuff. Let's get some air. All right, let's go down back this way around the back. We got a door we can open up. And another locker with some stuff in it. That door does not open. Okay, let's get some air. There's nothing on top of here. Check around the back. And then let's go back down and see if we missed anything else down through here. Does not appear that we did. That's the door that's broken. Okay, so let's get back out. All right, we're going to get these tires and take them to shore okay I think we're done here we got a couple of groupers we might as well nab them since they're right here just gonna be one of those ones that we can't kill that are bugged out yeah it looks like it let's see if the other one <coughs> we can nab him yeah we got him okay let's grab him take him to shore with us Okay, I'm just going to leave him there for now. Uh, let's also pick up this rock. So I'm out of stone, so if I 
I want to get any more rocks, I'm going to have to make a pick, which we're going to have to do eventually. So, um, you know, we'll see if we can get away with not having to do that before we leave. Now, we also have that wreck out there, and we kind of took a quick look. Oh, look, pee, pee plant. How did I miss that? Goodness gracious. All right. There's more rocks here, too, I want, and some more corrugated. I wonder if that stuff, like, washed up on shore or something. I don't know. Let's put this over here. We'll put, throw the pee-pee down for now. Let's make sure... Uh, no, actually, let's go out and do this one next. I do have a tiger shark that I need to settle a score with, so it would be a good idea for us to make the better spears, refined spears to deal with with that. Okay, let's open this door. We got one thing with some planks in it. And I'm kind of stuck right here. Okay, let's, oh, there's a container. Okay, let's grab that. And that's probably all we're going to get out of this little, little little ship here. That's stone? Oh, no, that's clay. Okay. Okay, let's head back to shore. <coughs> and then we get, we're going to look at this other ship. There's a crown of thorns. We don't want to step on that thing. Okay, I'm just going to drop these for the moment. I'll worry about sorting, consolidating, organizing, etc. later. Alright. Okay, let's check this wreck. See, I think that might be a player island out there. I mean, it's got a lot of stuff going on. It's definitely going to be the next one we're going to check. Alright, let's... Well, there's a lionfish. We need to watch out for him. That door doesn't open. This door does. Okay, now what do we got going on in here? Uh, one of those. Okay. That looks like that's about it. I don't know. Is there a lower section we can get to? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, we found three sets of tires, so that's another pontoon for our raft. We need a total of two more pontoons, though. I mean, I suppose I could try and get the barrels out of the big ship. That's a bit of a pain in the butt to do that, but it would be an option. Let's run around. Oh, look at this, you guys. Nice. Our palm saplings have respawned, so that means we can get a whole nother batch of lashings going before we leave this place. All right. That is awesome. But yeah, look at that island over there. That definitely looks busier than any other vanilla island I've seen so far, so I think we have a good chance of that being a player island. Player-made island, I should say. Okay, so let's go swim out and see what's going on over here. Got another container. So we'll grab that. <laughs> Looks like there's an area that we can go down into, but let's see. Is there anything in here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's get some air. And then go down through here. Got a container there. And nothing else that way. Kind of a glitchy container there. And I think that's it. Okay. Let's go back to shore. Make sure there's there's a crown of thorns right there, so let's go this way. Oh man, I'm stoked that we are going to be able to do another harvest of palm saplings. That's going to help tremendously. Okay, so we have looked at every single wreck around this island, as far as I know. Well, let's go back to the the big boy. 
We never come. I don't think we completely finished looting the underbelly of that guy. And I'm going to take some air tanks with us too. Let's save. And let's hit that one last time. We'll be able to stay under a little bit longer with these air tanks. Hopefully the damn shark will leave us alone. But we might just, uh, if he shows up again and harasses me even more, we're going to we're going to teach him a lesson that he'll not soon forget. Okay, let's go down through here. All right, we might as well go up here and grab some air. I don't want to use the air cylinders any more than we have to, just because we need them for other things. Yeah, we might have a really hard time getting those tires out of here. We might indeed. Okay, let's go back into the main area here. I'm going to break these loose. I don't know that we're going to do them, but let's break them loose because they are an option. Okay, there's another container. Good. Uh, let's see if we can pop out and get some air here. All right, back down. Here's some more barrels. Oh, lionfish. Okay. I don't know why the game does that. That's a little bit of a bug, too, that it does, where it says you're so. Selling... Oh, we've got an air pocket in here. Oh, nice. Well, we do because of the storm. It's probably not normally in here. But we'll take advantage of it. Like I said, if I, don't, if I can get away with not having to use my air cylinders, that would be nice. Let's see if... Uh, we get another wave. Oh, just, just about, just about, not quite. All right, well, I think that's it for loot in here. Right, we're going to have to go out and get some air. So we have really two choices at, at this point now. We could either, we could either, um, Try and get three barrels out. Or we could just make a wood pontoon. Um, honestly, because I, I, I think we're going to just go over to that other island, and if it's a player-made island, we'll very likely stay there and make that our, uh, our main base, or at least our first base. I don't know if I want to screw around right now trying to get those barrels out, especially in this weather. So let's just make... Let's just make a wood pontoon with the... Yeah, he's another invincible grouper. Uh, a wood pontoon for that last piece, because this raft is probably um, not going to be our main raft anyways, unless I decide to keep it and build onto it later. And, you know, we can always change those things out, too. We're not stuck with it permanently. So, that being the case, um, let's get that there. Uh, we'll drop this guy here for now, I guess. Let's get some food. We need to eat. Not really. Okay, let's just put food in here for now, then. Got a couple more crates. Let's just look at them really quick. Okay, we got binoculars, more cloth, more stuff. In another air cylinder, which is great. Okay, let's go grab those tires. Bring them over here. Okay, so let's see here. We want to grab a lashing. Which is going to be in crafting mats. We actually need two more lashings, I think. Grab these guys. Get them nice and close together. Oh, we're going to also need our hammer. Let's drop our knife right there. So let's see, tools and weapons. We'll grab a hammer. Okay, it's not going to let us do that from there. So oh, we only need two tires, don't we? Why is it not? 
registering that I'm standing right on top of two tires. What the hell? Uh. All right, let's take them back over here. We're right on top of each other. There we go. I don't know why this game does some of the things that it does. Uh, all right, we're going to put that there. Yeah, it's a, kind of a bummer that we... Man, if we could just get one more tire out of that place, then we wouldn't have to make a... You know, the stick pontoon. All we would need is one tire, ladies and gentlemen. Just one tire. Um... Anyway, let's grab a couple of pieces of corrugate. We're going to put that there. Okay. those planks there. Now, I... I have... We have one piece of corrugate in there. And, and another piece in here. And another piece in there, too. Um... Let me look at something here. Oh, yeah. That... Corrugate floor. It doesn't take any lashings at all. You know what I think I'm going to do? And this is a little bit wasteful, but I want stuff to look uniform as much as possible. Okay, so let's grab this. There we go. All right, now we have to put a minimum of one more raft pontoon out in front here to enclose this so that we can then put storage bins inside. So what we're going to do is let's, um, let's put the tools back in here for now. And the crafting mats... And I'm just going to put these guys here for the moment. Because we can use these planks for other things. Let's grab, once again, our air cylinder. I have one here. Um, and actually, yeah, let's grab a flashlight too. That might come in handy. And we're going to go back in this ship and just see if we can manage to get squeak one tire out. Turn our light on here. Oh, no. Wait, what? No, I don't want to go up here. That's not what I want to do. All right, let's go down here. Where the hell am I at? Here, let's go up here and get some air. <sighs> All right, we want to go down into this room over here. So we have more barrels there and we have tires. Oh, where do we have tires? Can I get out here in time? Oh, that's close. That was close. All right, I thought there was tires. Yeah, there's tires right there. Okay, let's um loosen those guys up and see if we can grab one. Can this door open? Yeah, it can. Oh, 
There's a room we missed. All right, let's get some air. I know I have the cylinder, but I'm trying to preserve it. Is there any way I can pop this out through here? See, it's not turned the right way. I could get it to go long ways. All right, what if we bump into it like this? Oh, it doesn't have collision, does it? Can we push it this way? Yeah, it's kind of wedged in there, isn't it? Damn it. Okay, well, let's forget about that one. Let's grab this one. Well, um, having tr trouble maneuvering here. Let's just break these tires. Okay. We need to get... Uh, down into the, sh uh, the cargo bay. Here, we got a... Nice, we got another lantern. Because I might be able to push one of these tires out the the hole, you know, the breach in the hull there. But we gotta go down here and into here to do that. Eh, I don't know, man. That just seems a bit tough to get it out that way. <laughs> Okay, so can we grab this tire? Pull it down here. And get it through this door. Oh, we did. We got it through the door. Okay, good, good, good. All right, we're going to have to take this. All right, now let's grab this and go over by the breach. I gotta figure out where it's at. Okay, it's right over here. Now, can we get it through here? This is shark territory. But, I don't know, are the sharks out at night? Anyway? I mean, you'd think they would be, right? Just can't get it through there. Come on, tire. Down, and then... Oh, uh, shit. Let's take this. Can I use this? Oh, I can use this underwater. Nice, that's way better than the flashlight. I'm trying to pull it out and under. No, it's not going to happen. Maybe it's possible, but that isn't going to work. Okay, well, in that case, we're just going to make a wooden pontoon in the front. Or a wooden stick pontoon. So I've just done that to, to begin with, but I wanted to give it one more try. Yeah, man, the lantern's the thing to use underwater, not the flashlight. I didn't know it worked underwater. I do now. Okay, so how many sticks do we need for the raft pontoon? We need 14 sticks and <clears throat> excuse me, and one lashing. I mean, I know I could also try and fight the barrels, but don't really want to do that. Don't really want to do that. Okay, so. Let's just stick this over here. What's inside of it? That stuff. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, we have enough sticks. Uh, we're going to need one lashing, so let's grab that out of crafting mats. We're down to two lashings left. We have our hammer, right? Yeah. Let's drop this guy over here. Let's also take a lantern with us. I actually want, I want to make a lantern uh, light post thing for the raft, too. Um, but for now, let's just set it right here. Okay. Let's do a wood raft base here. Should be able to stick it onto the end of that, like so. Excellent. All right. Now what we want to do is we want to... We should have... We have a corrugate there. Uh, nope, not there, not there. I don't think we have enough corrugate to make another corrugate floor, which kind of sucks. These should all be empty. Oh, here we go. Perfect, okay. Excellent, okay. So now what we can do is we can take our... Um, our crates and we can stick them down in this middle section and we can actually should be able to fit up to seven crates in there if it doesn't glitch out uh, we were trying to do this on the multiplayer game and we're having some problems but we were having a lot of other types of problems on the multiplayer game too so I'm not that doesn't mean we're gonna have problems here okay so one of the thing that I would like to make is if we go back to crafting and we go here I want to make a light hook so that's two sticks and one lashing okay so let's do that now remember we have repopped plant fiber palm sapling things so I'm gonna pick all of those before I actually leave uh, so let's grab one of those and we're gonna need some more sticks too got some logs sitting over here so let's cut these up crafting here and here and we want for some reason this sticks way up in the air uh, something they they got to fix and now we can put the lantern up oh hold E there we go now we have some light on our raft a light to guide the way and brick and basket. All right, you guys. So what is left is for me to load up the raft with our container. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the containers out to the raft. And we're going to drop them like so. And then position them inside of here. See, they do, they do get a little squirrely. See, I, did, I haven't done this on buoy balls. I've done it on tires. So I don't know, maybe buoy balls are a little more unstable. If you stand on that, it really does the little shake, shaky thing. But we want to turn it this way because then we can get more in there. And, and we should be able to get up to seven in there, assuming they behave. And then, of course, you know, that gives us more storage to put stuff in the raft. So what I'm going to do is um, everything that we've got organized here, um, I'm going to, you know, take in my inventory as much as I can. But then we can also, you know, put the, the crates in there to, to store them too. And then, you know, once we get to our main base, I'll, I'll just leave empty containers on that and then we can go to other islands and gather wood and whatever and have place you know enough room to hold a bunch of stuff back in so that's the plan anyways hopefully it'll work out but I'm gonna let you guys go here what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go around the island and harvest the next batch of fibrous leaves so we have you know plenty of those to take with us 
I'll probably make some more of the refined spears uh, too, uh, so that when we do get to the next island, we have uh, you know the better spears to fight you know the critters with. Because undoubtedly, especially if it's a player-made island, I'm sure we're going to have enemies to deal with. And in the next episode. We should be getting out of this place. So hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.